Hello you guys, this is Mika with Living with Mika and welcome and welcome back to my channel. Um, before I get started, because it might be a little lengthy, I'll be trying to cut them video down as you know, short as I can, but they still end up being like, you know, in the 50s. So I'm sorry, but I'm glad you guys are enjoying them though. Um, first, I want to say thank you. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart to all of my new subscribers. You guys rock. You guys rock. You guys rock. You guys are bringing, bringing the positivity and the great vibes, okay, to my channel. And I appreciate it. I've been waiting for this for a very, very long time now. For y'all to come over here and join me, you know what I mean? Yeah. So anyways, I just want to say thank you again to all the new subscribers. Thank you for everybody that has been rocking with me, you know, for a minute now. And um, yeah, let me just get on into this haul and stop rambling. All right. Yes, I'm missing a nail. I didn't feel like gluing another one back on. So y'all just excuse me. Okay. I want to get this video up. Okay. So right now I took everything out of the Timu bags to make it easier uh, for me to get going. All right. So. And I hope my angle is good. It looks like it is. So let's get going. Right now, I'm, I'm going to start with the shades, okay? So I got some Timu shades, you guys. And so got the V right there, you guys. You see the V? These are cute. Gold hardware. <laughs> Red and gold, okay? We're going to get into this, all right? Oh, they're nice and dark, too. Ooh. Mm. Yes, so tell me what y'all think about these shades, all right? Because I think they're cute. They didn't come with no little fancy case or anything, you know? They just came in the little, in a box with the plastic and a bag you know they didn't come with a case or anything but i still think they super cute so y'all let me know what y'all think about these i like the the fact that it has the uh v on the side with the gold hardware that's what caught my eye about these you guys and they sturdy like i said they make good shades you know i remember going to the mall years ago with my husband and um i'd want to buy some shades and they'd sell them i think they were selling them for uh two for ten or something some i don't know they cut you a little deal if you buy two and i don't know anyways i'm glad i i'm glad that um timu got their shades so low like they're like two dollars and stuff you know i like that you know you're getting really good quality shades for the low low and i ain't mad I'm gonna get rid of that box, child. We're just gonna keep the bag, all right? All right, we're gonna get into the next pit. Y'all, I'm trying to make sure, girl, I'm trying to make sure I don't have no nip slip. <laughs> and this one only came in the box, you guys, and a plastic bag. That was, you know, that was it. But let's get into these. They is cute. Look at that. Look at that. I just think they're cute. They're super, super duper cute. And I don't think that's gold. I think that's a, a silver, uh, I think that's like a, a gray, a chrome or whatever you want to call it. You know, let's get into it. It's orange, you guys. Yes. Yes, so these are nice, you know, if I ain't trying to really be on my dark mode like sometimes i like to wear dark glasses because believe it or not i can be somewhat of an introvert at times where i just don't like to talk to people and i feel like if my eyes are covered people won't feel free to just open up conversation with me because they don't know if i'm looking at them or not you know so that's why i like to wear dark shades sometimes but these are cute you know for them days where i just feel like you know you know, basically uh, being that girl, you know what I mean? Like, you know, 
you see me, I see you <laughs> type of look. You know what I mean? You know, you know, you know I'm giving, you know, type of look. <laughs> so yeah, these is them kind of shades. It's like, I see you, boo. Mm -hmm. I know you looking, girl. I know you see me too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah, these are super cute. I've never owned anything like this before. All right. And um, yeah, and I'm trying to jump out of the box and get more of the colors going on here with the shades. So I got the red, I got the um, orange. You guys saw last week, I got the white. Um, so yeah, I don't have yellow yet. Let's see what these are. These are in a baby blue case. So these little fancy ones did come in a case. I'm excited about that. Okay, the case is plastic. Okay, a little flat. Girl, these is cute. <laughs> so they come in a plastic. They got their little, you know, fancy. They got the little cleaning cloth. You know, they came in their little plastic bag to protect them. And they also came with a little cushion on the bottom to protect the lens if you don't want to put it back in the plastic. Yes, period. Boy. So let's get into these, girl. And I knew it was given. Given some kind of a high-end, you know, look about her. I liked the fact that she was a nude you know a, cr a creamish you know the nude color she matches what i'm wearing she matches what i'm wearing today and yes so anyways let me get into this i can see through these so clear they feel like they don't have any kind of tint to them at all but looking at looking at me you would see a tint but looking through them i don't see a tint not at all but aren't they cute okay get into it get into it you guys i will have links in the bottom of the description if you're familiar with my videos these are a little loose though you guys a lot of the other ones feel kind of tight on my face these are fitting a little loose they're not fitting as tug tight as the other ones so but you know around the ear coming off like around the ear is tug but you know they did feel a little loose but that's not you know that's not bad i mean i just want to let you guys know if you have little heads you know i had a little head so yeah i'm gonna put these back in the plastic these are cute you guys i really like them see I, these like i said last last haul that you know i'm not from you know i'm i'm trying to get used to um buying the timu shades so yeah so far so good i like the timu shades i own three four pair now and um uh, yeah they're they're cheap you know you can't be going and buying shades for like two and three dollars so nowhere so that's just a great great buy um next i'm going to get into these little tiny things that I have sitting around here. So in this one right here, I have, it's a whole bunch of um, ring ringlets for your fingers. I have small fingers, you guys. So it's really hard for me to find stuff to fit my fingers, but we'll see. I know I said I was gonna do some toe rings, but um, I really have not seen any that I like yet. I don't know. The ones that I see just don't look good. They look very cheapity cheap, but these look nice. And they they feel sturdy and stuff. Okay, there's only, wait, how many of them got holes in the um, cracks in the bottom? So this one right here has a crack in the bottom. So I guess that means it's adjustable. And this one right here has a crack in the bottom, so that must mean it's, it's adjustable. But a lot of them don't have cracks in the bottom, so. But yeah, so what I've been looking for is a pinky ring, y'all. And I don't think I'm going to get one, because my pinky, 
is like a uh, look at that. My pinky is every bit of probably like uh, my ring finger is a six. I'm thinking my pinky is probably like a four or five. So yeah. Anyways, these are oh, how many came in here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10 10 rings you guys and they all i'll post a picture of them like i always do but these rings all have unique the designs are uh they look real real the designs look really real so moving on you guys this right here i sell things on poshmark so um, when I sell things, sometimes I be wanting to say thank you, um, but, and I be wanting to put it on, like, you know, when I wrap their things really nice in tissue paper, I be wanting to have, I tape it. I normally just tape the tissue paper. Um, but right here they have the little stickers that say thank you. I don't know if you can see that. They have the little cute stickers that say thank you. So I was like, okay, instead of taping my tissue paper, I can just put this little thank you on there like that. I just thought that was really cute. I'm going to put that with all my Poshmark, you know, packing, wrapping stuff. And that's just going to come in handy, period, point blank. So if you guys uh, look at the link in my description on my Poshmark, I did post some Nike sports bras, their size medium. I have a few purses posted as well. I have a Dooney purse and I have a Juicy Couture purse. I have um, some a Juicy Couture wallet that I just uploaded today. So go over there and check out my Poshmark, you guys, and purchase something from me. I have so much more stuff to sell on Poshmark. I just haven't uploaded the... It takes a while for me to take the pictures and upload and things. I don't know. Anyways, let me get back into this haul, y'all. So, this one right here is a bracelet. And it's a Dior bracelet, you guys. So, and she looks like that. The Dior. I think that's so cute, you know. I like it. I hope all the letters fall at the same angle because right now I don't look like they are. Oh, there they go. There they go. Yeah, that is so cute. So that's just another little anklet. I wonder if I could put it on my um ankle. Let me, I say anklet anyway. I think it's a bracelet. But my, ooh, girl, it fits on my, ooh. Girl, it fits on my ankle. Okay, so we got an anklet now. I always wanted an anklet. Okay, get into it. So, now I have a Christian Dior anklet. Okay, let me show y'all. Let me show y'all, let me show y'all. Let me show y'all what I'm working with. I don't know if y'all can see that, but that's my anklet. Ain't she cute? Okay. Get into it, get into it. I'm just happy because at first I thought she was just gonna have to go on. And I got, you know, I got that one. You know, I got those and I got these. So I got, well, wait a minute. So I'm, I'm done at this point ordering bracelets. Okay, you guys, I'm done because this one, right here caught my eye okay y'all okay that's so cute get into it get into it look at th look at this isn't it cute you guys so it's a um bracelet but 
I don't know. It just has diamonds all the all the way around it. Diamonds all the way around it. Diamonds all the way around it. And um, she's really cute. I'm trying to figure out how she opens though. Cause she has oh it, oh okay I get it. So this pops off like that, and then she oh okay like that. I'm done with the bracelets, but I just thought this was just so stinking cute. Okay. It's just so cute, you guys. So cute. So yeah, I'm done with the bracelets now. I kind of like got my little bangle thing going on over here, y'all. I think it's cute. It's so fancy. So fancy. <laughs> so anyways, that's that. I think that's cute. All right, you guys. So anyways, um, washing my hair lately. I really don't know what's going on. My hair is... My husband told me, though, he said, during the summer, your hair sheds a lot. I'm not understanding why again. He explained it to me, but I can't, I don't understand. He said, like, 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 in the winter, like, animals even, like, in the winter, their hair gets a lot thicker because it keeps them warm. And then in the summer, they shed. So... He thinks that that's what's going on with my hair. I don't know, but my hair has been shedding a lot, and I've been having a lot of hair in the um, in the bathtub drain. So I don't like that because you know I don't. I just don't like clogging up the drain. My husband pulled out. Y'all should have seen all the hair he pulled out of my drain when he changed over the drain. So I saw this on Timo and it's you lay it it's basically flat on the bottom so it's gonna work perfect for me it lays flat over the drain you know it has the little curves in here that fits right it's gonna fit my my drain perfect because this is exactly how my drain is and then i just lay it over my drain when i'm washing my hair and then this catches all the hair with the um little grooves there so this is going to come in handy. When I saw this on Timu, I was like, yes, because I've been losing so much hair. We ain't going to be clogging up no drains no more because I like this. And I hope it comes in handy, and I'll let you guys know. And here, we're moving along. So these right here are little box, box openers um, or envelope openers even, you know. They're little razors. So I got two of these. I got one for me. As you can see, they're pink. My daughter loves pink too. So I got one for her, one for me. And they're basically envelope openers. You just slide it right through the envelope and it just cuts the envelope. I thought that was pretty fancy. Just slide it right through the envelope and open it. So yeah my little tiny items i'm trying to get through them really quickly guys i really should have timed myself i don't know how long i've been on here so far this right here i thought was going to come in handy on my um, medicine cabinet i don't like to keep my razor in my shower because my fear is that my little boy will get it and cut himself so they have this little sticky back and it's stainless steel. It's like a hook that you can put your razor on. Uh, so I'm going to stick this on the inside of my medicine cabinet. Probably like on the side of the wall. And then I'll just hang my razor there. So um, that it's out of the way. And you know, I don't have to worry about my little buddy getting hurt. I don't want him to get hurt. But I thought this was just a, little, a great idea. Um, so yeah. I got that for my razor. It's an autistic awareness a keychain. So but I still I don't know. I might where would I put this? I can hang it on my 
keys or my purse or something like that but it's just cute you know it's like a, a little reminder of my little boy who is autistic and for all my new subscribers i have an autistic son who just turned 12 in march so yeah he's nonverbal, but he's a joy a lot of work though but he's a joy <laughs> he is that's my buddy so moving on i'm gonna do something fun with you guys real quick so you guys are enjoying my fragrances so i got something for you real quick i only ordered one fragrance this time because like i said um in the comments i was comment commenting to a few of you guys saying that the fragrances don't really last long oh i smell this right through the box Oh, I, this is amazing. So this is a dupe of the um, Burberry Her. And the name is Daisy Deer. Flower and Her. Okay, that's the name. And, and the thing that's really heartbreaking about this whole thing is that if you buy this in the store, the bottle is big. It depends on what, how many ounces you buy, but you know, more than likely you're gonna buy a bigger bottle than this. This is like, this box reminds me of uh, the hotel room soaps. <laughs> You know, the little tiny soap that you get, the traveling soap. <laughs> That's what this box reminds me of. Oof. So anyways, the bottle looks like that. A little dusty. A little dusty. They could have cleaned the bottle, too. Anyways, let's get into her. Girl, I don't even have to spray a box. I don't have to. I don't have to spray this nowhere. This smells good. Okay, Daisy, dear. Like Daisy Deer, so I like Daisy Deer. Um, look like we got some leakage. Is she leaking? Okay. Anyways, she got a little plastic lid. You know, it's a great little dupe. You know, Daisy Deer again. She smells really nice, you guys. I'm not gonna sit her on my couch because I think she's leaking. But yeah, that's Daisy Deer. All right, let's get into this next one, you guys. I, don't, I hope I'm moving fast here. I hope so. Let's get into this one. So we got, we got a light, you guys. We got a light. I got the remote control right here. It looks like that. Let's get into her. Oh, she already pre-lit. She got a charger. I don't know. I just pulled her out, y'all, and she lit up. She lit up. Look. This is gorgeous. This is gorgeous. So it's a touch light or something? Yeah, so you... Look at that, y'all. So I got this because... I be needing a nightlight in my bedroom. I'm sorry. Like on my dresser when my husband is asleep and I'm looking for something or even when my husband wakes up in the morning and he want to turn off the alarm clock, you know, he could touch the top of this and be able to see or, you know, I probably wouldn't use this one because it got too many different lights to it. He's not going to want to go through all these different lights just to try to turn this thing off. Um, it has a remote control though, so that's the pretty cool thing too. So either way, you charge it with the little charging cord right there. 
and it has the little remote control here for it and it's just it's cute it looks very very sleek and elegant uh very fancy and just elegant looking i just don't know how to turn her off does she go off on her own you know very um I don't know what's going on. It just turned from clear to green. Girl, it's pretty. It's elegant, okay? That's a girl, does it turn colors? Girl, I don't know. Anyways, she cute. Hey, she, I know she cute. Anyways, I, I will leave the link on the bottom for her. Oh, I got a dress. I got some outfits. Well, I pretty much got a dress. Some dresses. So, I got a long like maxi dress you guys so i never get clothes from timo so i got this long maxi dress she has like a she has like the little cut little cut right here in the neck area like a little cut i will post uh i'll post her she's kind of see-through I think, you know, with the light, I don't know. She's cute, that Nice and sketchy. So, you know, you guys, I will be trying this on for you. So, here. It's really, really cute. Oh. Really, really cute maxi, you guys. Uh, the only thing is, is that the back is out on her. Oh, and they're, they're mediums. They're size mediums, you guys. Um, on the sizing chart, for my size is a 10 12 they're saying that i should be in a large but i ordered mediums and they fit me perfect so i don't know but pretty much i wear a medium anyways true to size i wear a medium some women's clothes i have to wear a small but it it depends on how the stuff is made but yeah as you can see and I will show you guys a picture of the model in it as well. The model wearing it too. But yeah, the back is out, but it's really cute. I'm probably, I have a, um, like a halter top that I'll probably wear with this. That way I'm not showing too much of my upper part. All right, this is the last one, you guys, as far as the dresses go. And this one, I really, really liked. It was like a tube dress. Like a tube dress. So, it's just, you know, strapless. Tube dress. I think, does it have any slits? No, it don't have any slits on the sides. But, you know, these are just cute little maxi dresses to wear in the summertime with heels. Heels, you crazy. I ain't about to wear nobody heel. These are cute maxi dresses to wear in the summertime with, like, some uh, sandals or clods. You know, the, the little the wedges, you know. So, yeah. I just thought that was cute. And that perfume smells so good. Put this back in the bag. So her bag looks different than all the other bags because it it says Zitch. Zitch. I don't know what Zitch is, but I will try these dresses on for you guys. They look so cute. Okay. Let's get into this. So as you guys can see i am like i'm trying to slow down though on the louis louis stuff they had a louis on there today that looked uh a little bit like the um gun the the gun uh tote like like purses i don't know it's the shape you know it was really cute i think i think dior makes makes the bags but it was a Louis one. I'll show you a picture of it. So I saw these on there. And they're basically for your keys. It's just a little a little pouchy. 
that you can hang from your keys and then like you can have like your house key on here you know it only has one hook pretty much so i guess you can you can weave probably as many keys as you want on here but yeah i don't know might just do a house key and then there goes the little clip part right there like that so i thought this was just so cute cute little and dainty you can hang it off your purse you know and your key is ready to go all right let's get into this these are the last items you guys and then i'm going to end this video and i hope it's not too long so, I don't know if you guys are familiar with uh, Von Dutch. It actually says Von Dutch. I don't know, but I did Google the ori original uh, Von Dutch, and this one looks a lot like it. It really does. It looks a lot like the original Von Dutch. So, yeah. Let's get into her. try her on for you guys really quick I'm trying to loosen up the strap they had the strap pulled pretty tight didn't they so let's check her out guys she ain't got no pockets nowhere but it's okay she's cute see if i can do her as a crossbody y'all because she is Slippery. Yeah, she works really good as a crossbody. I like it. Y'all tell me how y'all like her. I think she's cute. Let me know what you think. I think she's cute <laughs> and I don't know what it is about me starting to get into the smaller bags I just I go through phases because um I used to love big bags I did now I just I don't know I want I want little bags now I don't want li I don't want big bags no more I just need a cute little dainty little bag I don't need the big bag. I think what it was, I used to get big bags because I could use them as like a diaper bag too. So that's kind of why I liked it, the big bags. It did come with a little duster, okay? So now let's get into this bag. Got two more bags, you guys. Two more bags. And I think I'm slowing down on Timu too. Um, I do have uh, another order. And then after that, I'm done. I, I think I, cause I have, I have handbags that I still haven't showed you guys from Amazon. I also have some handbags from, um, I got dupes from Amazon and I have uh, real um, name brand bags from Poshmark and i only spent like between 60 and 80 dollars for the bags and these are bags that cost way more than that so yeah i gotta show you guys those so this color get into this color so i thought this color was oh by the way <laughs> get into this bag so this is the Steve Man bag that all the girls was raving about, okay? Everybody was raving about the Steve Man bags, okay? The Steve Madden bags came back to Timu, y'all. They got them on Timu again, and I will link it. And I, it's crazy. I don't know how Timu getting these bags. <laughs> I don't 
But I did hear uh, some YouTubers talk about these bags a while back, and they was like, Timu got steam man bags. Timu got steam man bags. Girl, come with the big strap and the little strap. Girl. I don't know how Timu doing this. I really don't. But they blowing me away. But like I said, I'm taking a break. I think I'm getting a grip on my addiction, you guys. I, I'm slowing down on Timu. I just think this bag is made very well. I just saw somebody on Poshmark selling one of these, the real thing, for $55. I don't know how much they are in the store, but she's selling the real one. It was blue, very pretty, for $55. Um, this bag right here was like $18 or something like that and yeah so i'll link the bags in the so that this one's made like this cute little zipper i mean just cute it zips up like like that over here on the side oh can y'all see that i don't even read zips up like this and then it just unzips right here like that no, does it have any pockets or anything? Hold on a second. I'm looking for pockets. What's going on here? Let me see something. Oh, okay, that's the divider. So there's a divider in here that you can actually reach down and touch the other side. It's just a divider. It, you know, it's not sealed off from the purse. So, like, if you have change, if you put change in this pocket, it's more than likely going to travel over here to this pocket because they are connected. They just have, like, a divider going down the middle. That's all. But other than that, just cute, just cute. A little tight, a little tight in there, you know, a little tight. So the strap is kind of like attached to a zipper on the side. I don't know what the heck that's all about. What is this? Oh, you got a little pouch. How cute. Ain't that cute? So I was saying that the strap was attached to something with a zipper. It was a little a change pouch. So that's cute that it comes with a little change pouch. You put your little change in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like that. Okay, so that was a, a, a something I didn't expect. And then on the other side where it says Steve Madden, you have a, a pocket, a little pocket in there. But other than that, yeah, this purse is that. It's just that, okay? Um, yep, the, the button is magnetic. The button is magnetic. Um, am I a fan of this bag? I think it's cute. Um, to me, it doesn't really, um, it's, it's just cute. It's not really useful. It isn't very useful. Um, I did order a yellow one, but because I just tried this one out and I'm not, I'm not really sold on it, you guys, because like I said, to me, it's just beauty. It's not really useful. Like, the pockets aren't really uh, wide. I, I'll clean all that up, you guys, when I'm done. Do I like the big strap with the little strap? Yes, that, that's nice, because then you don't have to worry about a little strap digging into your shoulder or anything. I personally don't think that I think that's what it is this bag is just cute um, you can't really put a lot in it it's just cute okay it's it's just not useful it's really tight it's a tight squeeze in there to try to get in and out putting stuff in you know just yeah, this is not one of those bags you're going to really use for a lot of stuff. All right, you guys. So I hope my camera don't have you guys cut off. I'm trying to scoot you guys closer. And 
I I have my camera reversed so it's kind of hard for me to see if my whole body is in the camera or not I really don't like this setup but it is what it is um, I'm going to try this bag on for you guys right now and yeah let's get into this bag right here and then i'm going to end the video so let's see can i do it in a let's see what this strap is like so i can do the chunky strap i can probably do the chunky strap in a crossbody mm -hmm. matches what I'm wearing mm -hmm. yeah so this is the Steve Matten bag the yellow one is going to look just like this one um Actually, this one, I want to say, was 18 or something like that. I'll, I'll post it. I know this yellow one, I spent 20 And it may be bigger. I don't know what the difference is, really, to tell you the truth. I, I don't know. It looks like it's the same exact bag. I don't know why I paid more for it. Um, because I just opened my, it's kind of like a, this is kind of like a mint green or something like that. Mint green. I don't own a mint green bag. Um, I do own a yellow bag already from Amazon that I need to do the haul with you guys. I'm telling you, them Amazon, uh, dupes that I got <laughs> are nice, are, are like bomb, you know? So, um, and the Amazon bag that I do have that is yellow is shaped exactly like this. So with that being said, I think I'm just going to go ahead and send this one back. I'm not even going to open her. Yeah, I'm not going to open her. I, I guess I am. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Because I want to know what, why was she $20? Okay. So we do want to open her. We want to know why she was $20, right? I want to know too. Okay, so she's different. Same everything except for the lettering. So the lettering is more of a, okay. So this one right here, the cheaper one, the lettering is, is different. So yeah, that says that, that, that changes a lot me I don't know I don't know so that's the difference that one the lettering is pretty much um, uh, engraved in of some sort this one right here has the letters actually popping off actually popping off does that matter to me though I don't think it does much but that's the difference, girls. That's the difference. The letters actually stand out more on the $20 bag. Hmm. Mm. It's cute. Uh, but like I said, it's just... Oh. Oh. That one opens up more. Hold on a second, y'all. Oh, this one opens up more, too. Yeah, this they do open up quite a bit. Okay. Let's see the bottom. It's still a divider. Yeah, still a divider. Um, oh. Oh. 
Another game changer. Okay, I understand what you're paying for now. So really to tell you the truth, this one looks more like it's better quality, okay? So that's what it is. Uh, Simu knows what they're doing, they do. This one is way better quality. So that changes a lot for me. <laughs> it changes a lot. <laughs> I'm not sending this bag back, guys. I think I'm going to keep her. Yep, she's staying here. I'm going to tear that off. It's worth it, you guys. It's worth it. Uh, you know what I've noticed about Timu? So if you guys are just wondering the differences with these bags, these two right here. Let me go ahead and hook her straps up. I know I've been on here too long, y'all. I'm going to have to edit so much. There you go. There's this one, you guys. Can you see her? This one is made so much better. So you be the judge, okay? Which one of these would you not mind purchasing? I mean, I'm glad now to tell you the truth because i was like thinking like why did you do that why did you order two different ones well the good thing about it is that now you know what they look like like you know what they're giving i mean they do look very 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 close to the same thing but you you get to see the differences though they're very close though. But now you know. <laughs> so that is that guys. That is the end of my haul. <sighs> Make sure y'all can see me. Oh gosh. So you see me okay? So that is the end of my haul, you guys. Um, I hope you liked the items that I was sharing. And uh, yeah, please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. It really helps me out. Feel free to share my videos, oh God, and let you guys and let other people, you know, get uh, to see the items that I'm purchasing as well, you know. Because you never know with who might want to purchase something that I have or whatever. I know I'm getting into watching other people's team moves hauls as well. So, yeah, let me know what you guys think about the items that I showed you guys today. And I'm going to get off of here and get in the bed. Uh, wash this makeup off my face and get ready to get in the bed. So, um, yeah, do what makes you happy. Until next time, you guys. Bye. I'm gonna hold you in my arms. I just wanna take the stress away from you.